You gonna get up? Oh, yeah, don't oh yeah, you're a good boy, aren't you? Did you sleep okay? Oh, you're so tired. You coming? Did you go to the toilet? Come on, then. Good boy. Oh, big stretches. I know. What are you doing? Get out! What are you doing? Silly sausage, what's this? Oh, it's a camera. Ups, ups. I know, oh, look, I can sleep out your mouth. Oh, you're so cute. Best boy. And the best doggy ever. Down. And trees? Oh! Ah! Wait! Ah! Good boy. Oh, yes. That's all you wanted, isn't it? That's all you wanted. Pretty goods. Pretty goods. Oh! Oh! Good boy. Good boy. Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today's video, I thought I would do an updated day in my life. Well, the day in the life of a pug. So if you didn't know, I do have a pug. He is three years old nearly in June. So next month he'll be three, which is absolutely mad because I feel like we only we only just got him, like the excitement of him and all. When we first got him was amazing. And yeah, he just is so cute. He's here with me at the moment. He just came upstairs to chill out with me. He must have known that I was gonna film this video. I don't know, but yeah, I just thought I would film an up-to-date version for anyone that has a pug themselves I'm sure you can relate for anyone that was thinking of perhaps getting a pug then this is the reality of having one and I do hope you like this video and I hope it fully it shows why they're an amazing pet to have they're just amazing dogs and great companions yeah I absolutely love them to bits his name is Rico so I'll just show you him here He's so cute, he literally just came up and he is like, pugs are known as lap dogs and he definitely is a little lap dog. He just wants to be where everyone is. To be honest though, like, I'm not his favourite, which is really upsetting, but Michael is his favourite, but he's downstairs painting at the moment, so I think he decided to get away from all that havoc downstairs and come up and spend some time with me, which I'm really appreciating because Michael only said to me earlier that he doesn't really care about me, which is really upset me. But yeah, I love it when he just wants to spend some time with me. He is the most loving, unloyal dog though at the same time if you have food he will treat he be a traitor to you and go and find make best friends with whoever it is who has treats basically so yeah what are you doing rick what are you doing you're the best little puppy aren't you yeah what are you doing are you gonna film with me are you having a nice little nap what's everyone doing today we all just annoying you yeah do you wanna? <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm sorry. Please don't hate me. This is probably the reason why he hates me because we all just wind him up all the time with like saying, Does he wanna go for a, you know, that one? And um, also food. Yeah. He's that, literally just sat there on the bed now waiting for me to bring him somewhere. And it's not happening yet. It'll happen later. It's just a bit windy outside at the moment. And yeah, so Michael's downstairs painting, so I just thought we would spend some time. Here, um, what have I got planned? I don't know if we're going to go for a WALK later just because the fact that it is quite windy. Um, the sun is coming out there at the moment, but it's really cloudy at the round. Like, there's little patches of cloud, but it's really windy. So I feel like 
it could change any minute the weather which is really frustrating and um, tomorrow's meant to be really nice so hopefully we get to go out yeah so hopefully we'll get to have a lovely day out tomorrow with him but he's just currently just sat here staring at me and i feel really guilty now so yeah fun fact they do make you feel guilty don't you oh he's a lovely boy you know paw yeah right he's not gonna do any tricks now just because the sheer fact that he knows they're so intelligent you're so intelligent aren't you you need a paw we go paw high five no okay not my friend anymore i'm sorry I promise we will later i promise yeah love you because it's Oh, give me some cuddles. Give me some cuddles. Give me a high five. Oh, good boy. Give me the paw. Shake hands. Paw. 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 No. Not going to perform for me now, are you? Good boy. You're the bestest doggy. You're the bestest doggy. Oh, 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 oh yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. And they just literally love to lick everything, don't you? Stop licking. Lovely. Lie down. Good boy, I love you. This is what I mean by the licking. Can you please stop? You're not licking the bed, you're licking a cushion, or you're licking me, or you're licking your paws, thinking you're a cat. Oh, <gasps> did I say where's the cats? They're not outside, they're not there today. Oh, yes they are, they said. They're not there, sorry. <laughs> you talking? What are you saying? Get that hair off your face. Don't there we go what are you saying what are you saying what are you saying Marie? can we go down come on then let's go let's go no okay on my own bye <laughs> we go come on Up on the wall. Oh, you had a hard day sunbathing. Hard day sunbathing in the garden. <gasps> well, I put a picture in of you in your little your little towel. You look so cute, didn't you? You look so cute. You look so cute. Oh, look, he's tired. You made the bed, but you ruined it, didn't you? You're always messing the bed up, huh? Yeah, you gonna say bye? So I say thanks everyone for watching this vlog. I hope you liked it. I hope it gave you a good insight to what it's like to own a pug. They are the most lovable little animals ever. Little dogs, sorry my breath, <laughs> as always. Um, yeah, I definitely recommend one if you are looking to get one. They're just the best little companion ever. So yeah, thanks for watching the vlog. If you do want to see more vlogs with my pug, then please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Bye.